Let's start by building our network topology by selecting the devices and the media. Several types of devices and network connections can be used for building networks within Packet Tracer. For this lab, we will keep it simple by using a few different end devices. This will include PC, laptop, switches, hubs, and the cables to connect the devices together. So in the bottom left hand corner, you'll find all the devices you'll need to build your network. In the far bottom left hand corner, I select end devices, a new list appears, and I can now see all the different end devices I can use in my network. So if I select the generic PC, the generic laptop, so these are my two end devices. Now if I go to the switches, I can select from a, a list of switches here, I'm going to select the 2950 24 port switch. And that's the same process if I wanted to select routers and hubs. So this is a very simple network. So once you've placed your hardware within your network, you'll need to connect it up. So if you select the icon that looks like a thunderbolt, you'll be presented with a list of different types of connections you can use in your network. Now, if you don't understand network cables media at this point, you can simply select automatically choose connection type, select the laptop, and then select the device you want to connect it to, and it will automatically make a connection. Alternatively, I can actually select the media, in this case a straight through cable, select the PC. I then need to select the actual port I want to connect it to, so it should be fast ethernet, that's the network card or network point on this PC. And then I select the switch port I want to connect it to. So I'm going to select the fast ethernet port and not the console port. So select a fast ethernet port, and now the network is connected.